guess what, peeps? Next time on Pokemon Uranium. I already did that joke, I know. Don't run away from me. You look like Mr. Richie, you know, like poor Tom. What? It looks um, like Barney the Dinosaur. I was about to say, it's Barney the Dinosaur's bizarre love child with a palpitoad. Okay, so you actually got a, a, a nice little type advantage here because it's poison type apparently, mm -hmm. and you're steel type. Yep. And I'm grass, and it's water. It looks water anyway. The river was full of it. The river was full of it. Scratch it. Scratch that itch. Scratch that itch. Maybe we're gonna scratch that itch. Scratch that itch. We're gonna scratch that itch. Scratch that itch. I don't know what song we're talking about, but okay. I mean, um, okay, so, so so the song I have is it's not really a, like it's kind of a reference to the song. I know I hear the song every once in a while while I'm, while I'm at my job. Uh, I do remember that scene from Grind when they go into like the the party where all the, the club and all the like maybe a little shake that thing. Oh little yeah, shake that thing. Yeah, that song. I don't know what that song is called, and I don't know who it's by, but I love that song a lot because it gets me gets me kind of moving and grooving. There's a new song that I love, but I'm not going to talk about it, mostly because Youngster Richie. Uh, uh, he wanted to talk about his high percentage fart hog. Fart hog. No, I like fart hog. Look like a gas Pokemon. It's a rugged rock, but a Pokemon may be able to smash it. How? Using some type of move? Why is it? Is it because it's night in real life? Everywhere's night. Does this have a, li a night cycle? Maybe. Huh, don't you know that if you talk to people multiple times, sometimes they would say different things. Yeah, just like that. Good work. I don't know what the voice this is. It's a... Uh, it's a... Uh, sounds like a half-assed Dracula. <laughs> He's like... What? I am... I am a Dracula. I am a Drac... I'm a Drac... <laughs> Danny Drac Vito. I'm a Dracula! Drac! We just moved to this town. It's small but homey. I think it'll be a good place to raise a family someday. She's talking about kids already? Why don't we... <laughs> couldn't we raise some Pokemon instead? You always start out with a dog. A dog is practice for kids. And everyone says that, but... Uh, everybody it, says it that, never, but the dog eventually dies. And, you. and you love the dog more than the kids. Bike repair shop. I want to get a bike. But this shop here doesn't have any. What a lame shop. Hey, kid, you a trainer? Well, if you want to know that you're head north, you're in reach Nocta. Not now talk city, which has the first gym ever. The first gym ever. Yeah, I was about to say it was like... This predates... Actually, they were talking about the Pokemon simulation games, blue and red. Okay, so... And I have an interesting theory. Ooh, you have to... That's neat. If you bring him a bike wheel, he'll give you a bike. Um, an interesting theory that, that I, I don't know if it's necessarily mine, but, okay, so we got in the first Pokemon game, uh, red and blue and green, yes. uh, we and were yellow. only able to get uh, one Eevee and a Lapras as gifts, right? Right. And in X and Y, we could catch them in the wild. Correct. Would that mean that, and natively, that those Pokemon are actually native to the Kalos to region? Kalos. That's a that's a pretty good uh, hypothesis because they're they've proven because they always refer to Pokemon like you know a, like in Generation Two whenever you would be in Johto and you could catch a uh, a Diglett. You know they would they wouldn't necessarily you know we would always say oh that old Pokemon. But to them, that's just that Pokemon that's always been there. Just like in Kanto, it's that Pokemon that's always been there. Yeah. And it's that one Pokemon that goes... Alright, so I'm going to buy some Pokemon Balls. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Uh, I, there's something nice I always like about throwing out a Pokemon I have in a Premier Ball. Yeah, like it's it's pointless. Like, but I like seeing that little white sprite because I'm like, yeah, it's like I caught that guy with nothing. Because it's just a Pokemon or a, uh, just a 
Is that an officer, Danny? Ah, hello again, trainer. Is this your first time maybe seeing a Pokemon Center? Come with me, I'll show you around. A Pokemon Center, first and foremost, is sort of like a hospital for Pokemon. My sister here will restore your... Blah, 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 blah. Our services are... <laughs> you know, if that was how it was in real life, there would be some douche that would come up and just be like, Can you heal my Pokemon? They're not hurt. Yeah, but can you run them through the machine in case they are hurt? Left is a PC. Somebody named Twitch. Because that was one of the developers of the game. Yeah. She's faster than I am. Up here we have the Tandor. Does it really let you? Yes. I didn't know that. You need to go home and start playing this right now. We got some orange berries. As I like to call them, Nero berries. GTS and Wonder Trade. You can what? That's awesome. Ah, oh, that's awesome. I'm so impressed. The guy's wearing a cape. I was about to say that's a that's an Ace Trainer or no? Uh, what do they call the Dragon Trainers? Uh, Ace Trainers. Okay. Whoops. Oh, yeah, no, that is the one that I had. I have double weakness to Orchinks. I just real or four times weakness. For at Torch? Yeah. I want to look at weird porn. It wouldn't let me. Uranium porn. And I keep accidentally hitting the. Restored your Pokemon to full health. Oh, that's great. Cool. You didn't even have the boop, 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 boop. Okay, so so these uh, nurse Pokemon is uh are, are jerks too because they're just like yeah go ahead and uh, we would like to see you again. I wish they put in some roads, some roads. Oh, strength. I need strength. And the only thing you can upgrade is strength. <laughs> this game is so essy. Do yourselves, do yourselves a favor, and uh, go watch dot dot dot. A review by, by Axman Thirteen. It's it's a thing of beauty. Why is the frame rate keeps dropping to like negative three? Shop? Does that mean I'm gonna fight a pseudo wudo or something similar soon? My girlfriend is mad at me, so I'm by the most realistic thing that's ever happened in a Pokemon game. Maybe. That's a, that's his girlfriend. Oh, Fairy Shop. Huh. Baku Berry. Guara Berry. Kupu Berry. These are all. Oh, I was about to say a Kai Berry. Let's see what they do. That's not items. Let's see. Pecha, we know. Oren, we know. That's a real berry. Mm -hmm. A Baku berry. Kupu berry. Yes, because it's normally a Ross berry, right? Isn't that the heals burns? Yeah. Guara berry. That's a... Uh... That looks like one of those weird... Uh, Berries or fruits or whatever you call them from uh, the Oracle games. Yeah. I heard out and nest in this area. I'm trying to catch one. Why well, she throws out an out? Let's get to Furby. I want to be its friend. I want to be all these Pokemon friends. The thing is, is like, even though these are all pretty good designs, like I. They still feel weird and not real. Yeah. Uh, it, it, okay. Uh, they don't have the same. Even though they're they're very high quality, they don't have the right feel to them. Okay. They, they, it, it definitely don't have that Pokemon look because like yeah. Pokemon have a very distinct look to them, even though they're so different. Right. It, 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 it's, it's like they have a design philosophy behind them. Mm -hmm. So. 
Which, I mean, they do have... Actually, I don't know, does... Does Ken Sumigori do all the original art now, still? I'm not quite sure. Did I say Sumigori? Sugo, Sugamari? Sumigori? Charge! He does have electric moves! Or... Or at least one, because charge is electric. I don't care what he does as long as he doesn't use Discharge. Is that cannon? <laughs> that escalated quickly! Steven, you know, I, I was telling you I've been watching a lot of Poketubers lately. Yep. Did you know that it's possible to catch underleveled Pokemon in the wild? Yes. Like, uh, in black and white you can catch a Dragonite at as low as level 50, even though they evolve at level 55. Wait, wait, wait. Dragonite? Yeah. Uh -huh. Yep. In black and white? Yep. I didn't know they were in the wild. There, it's in a special place. I think it might be in like Black Forest or White or White Forest or Black City or something. Oh, okay. But there's a way to find it. Well, uh, well, that's always been the case, even from Gen One, because there's a uh, uh, like you can catch Metapods at like level two, uh, like three or four. This catch, is true. Catch yourself a Burby. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the shrimp on the Burby. You already did that joke. Yeah, I did. You flat. You know Slash? I guess it's not an HM in this one. Or maybe he's just rude. <laughs> That's the sound of a Pokeball. You know, I still think the original GBA was my favorite design for it. Yeah. Even though the screen sucks. Uh, I'm a huge fan of the SP. That was the first one that I had. Okay. Um, what should we call it? It kind of makes me think of... <gasps> it makes me think of Meta Knight. Its name is Burby. Borb. 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 You know the comic that I'm referencing, right? No. Uh, King DDD is teaching uh, Kirby cuss words. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hey, kid, are you tough enough to make it through this cave? <laughs> uh, okay, so there, there's, there's a, a small a small aspect. It's your favorite. favorite. Small my favorite fighting type. Well, the beginning of my favorite fighting type, because Primeape's my man. Fine. Whip. Fight whip. Okay, so... Uh, what was I going to say? Okay, there's adults... Okay, everybody starts their Pokemon turret journey at 10, right? Right. Why are there adults with weak Pokemon? Maybe because not everyone becomes trained. Maybe somebody just has a pet and then... Bar... Baril? It looks like a horse group. Maybe, maybe somebody just has, like, has a family pet that they have had forever and they're like, you know what, I'm gonna go out and try my hand at battling. It's just like how you can find people nowadays, you know, even though it's less common, you know, almost everyone we know that skates, skated when they were like 13, but there are people who learn to skate when they're like 21 or, you know, even older. I don't want to take away from this guy at all for doing all this with a team, a, a very small team. But, like, some of the animations are a little un underwhelming. Ugh! Who is this? I just committed the ultimate oh. faux pas of recording. Yawning? Yes. Do -do 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 -do. Trade Pokepod numbers with me and I'll call you whenever I find a rare Pokemon. One Poet Isle. <laughs> I, I always like to call them potions. Which 420 Barrett. 
I hope he I hope he morphs into like a bear with butterfly wings. That's a, that just sounds like a My Chemical Romance song. He was a bear with the butterfly wings and I jumped out a second story window and he caught me cuz he's awesome and part of the black parade. <laughs> <laughs> Because that's totally how my chemical romance sounds. I love it. No, I do. <laughs> I, I think I would like my chemical romance more if every one of their songs ended up coming back to the Black Parade. Old entrance to now talk to Alright. Well, guys, we're going to delve deep in the next episode. All right. Thanks for watching. If you like this episode, uh, share it on MySpace. Are you kidding me? Zinger. <laughs> hey peeps, thanks for watching. If you like this video, please think about giving me a click on that like button. And uh, think about subscribing if you like my videos. Uh, if you like this series, feel free to click on the annotation to take you directly to the playlist so you can watch it from the beginning. If you have any comments, feel free to post them below or hit me up on Twitter at PJ Randall. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time, peeps.